<laughs> Good morning. It is... What day is it? It's Thursday. It's September 15. I swear I'm awake and I'm present and I'm here. Um, lately, as you should already know, uh, I've been writing a lot and like really a lot. And I don't know that I'm writing anything profound. <laughs> um, and mostly I'm writing in snippets that exist uh, in drafts and ideas between, you know, somewhere between when I wake up and when I go to bed. It's like an idea comes and I chase it and follow it and build it. <clears throat> uh, but what's been happening lately is because I've been writing more, my creative brain, I, like, I'm act, like I can f almost feel my creative brain turning back on and being like, oh, right, this is that thing we love to do. Um, and uh, last night I, I was just lying awake in bed with just this really active brain uh it didn't produce much but the night before i had one of those moments that happens every once in a while and i'm just going to assume uh, that it happens uh, to all of us because it has to um where just like in that moment between uh consciousness and unconsciousness between being wildly awake and, and, and you know, drastically asleep. Um, I had this, like, um, organization of thoughts, this stream of, of, like, pure consciousness of, like, an idea. And it was definitely related to a poem, and it was definitely related to, you know, um, an idea that I really, really liked, but as uh, sleep was pulling me in one direction, I, re I repeated the idea to myself multiple times and thought, I'll remember this when I wake up. I'll remember this. If I, if I wake up right now, I'm never going to go back to bed, and I need this sleep, and I need this sleep, but remember this idea, remember this idea, remember it, remember it. And I drifted off into sleep. And I woke up the next morning. And I got ready for work. And I was heading into work. I, I shot one of these videos. I headed into work. And on the way into work, there was a little bit that moment where like that light bulb, the idea of the light bulb came on, came in like poof. And I was like, oh my god, that thought. I had that thought, I had that thought. What was it? And I remember two words. I'm not going to share them now because they're weird and awkward. Uh, but I remember two words from the train of thought. Uh, and I have yet to rebuild it. I have no idea what the thought was. It's been 48 hours. Maybe more. I forget how time works. And that moment reminded me of somebody else's piece, uh, Buddy Wakefield, uh, which I've decided, rather than sharing my own work, <laughs> why would I do that? Um... I'm just going to share uh, the end of one of his poems uh, from Live for a Living. Uh, the poem is called Information Man, and the end of it goes like this. I know there are times you will lay your head to rest. You will have a moment of brilliance that grows into a perfect order of words, but you're going to fall asleep instead of painting it down on paper. When you wake up, you will have forgotten the idea completely and miss it like a front tooth. But at least you know how to recognize moments of brilliance because even at your worst, you are fucking incredible. It comes honest, so return to yourself, even if you're already there, because no matter where you go or how hard you try or what you do, the person you're ever going to get to be, the only person you're ever going to get to be, and I know it. Thank God is you.